Rumble, Beta, and everything after. Plus, a note on addiction. <laughs> I've been cranky, irritable, unenthusiastic regarding the appurtenances of the everyday. Blame the interrupted flow of particular chemicals my body has come to account for in maintaining its normal performance. The particular chemicals are these. Chemical the first, alcohol. As I begin to recover from my serious, mysterious malady, I find it easier to put on weight, and I need not do that. Therefore, I'm cutting out the infrequent nightcap and the far more frequent beer. Started over a week ago, but you know, I like beer. It took me a couple of years, but I found the stores down here in South Charlotte area that stock the good lagers, pilsners, stouts, and kirsch. So when I'm going without, when I'm abnegating, I'm cutting out things that I like, the ritual of it, the practiced pour and the light streaming through the amber, the taste and the chill, the soft bite of carbonation, and that rush of relaxation massaging the brain, even though I know that this last bit is simply the pleasant dulling effect of socially palatable poison. Oh, and the kids love hearing the burps. Hmm. Chemical number two, endorphins. Now, the science is not settled on this, but let us assume, for the sake of argument, blogged argument, whatever, that when we are addicted to things that do not themselves have a chemical component, it is our internal chemistry that dictates the existence and consequences of the addiction. So, yeah, endorphins. Brought on by, you guessed it, destiny. I've entered a stretch without it, see. First, there was prime family vacation, consisting of a five-hour airport delay spent keeping the four under ten primelets alive and entertained, followed by three days of comically outsized Chicago traffic and tourist expenses, then a nice couple of days with distant cousins in Milwaukee, although those days were marred by near-constant work interruptions. So, yeah, no gaming during the vacation. Then back home to D2 Beta Week, in which heavy workload went hand-in-hand with wifey Prime's newfound refusal to ever go to sleep at night to all but preclude my playtime. Ah, poor me. So yeah, two weeks now with nearly no destiny for old Septimus. And the chemicals are playing havoc with my insides and my mind parts too, which yes, are insides also. But check it out. I did a few early morning sessions with the beta, enough to form a hint of an impression. That being, hmm, a less polished half frame rate halo? But it's a start. And then, oh glory of glories, today I got in about 20 minutes of unexpected Destiny 1 clashing. And it was good. Who needs the main ingredient when there's the max range knee pads panta ray? The pleasure chemicals roared through me and my mood has been level set at all good man ever since. Finally update on the rumble grind. Even before my prior post, I had finished up the Rumble, rumble Grimoire Grind. I'll say that three times quickly. And almost immediately thereafter, I finished the Skirmish Grimoire Grind. Now, salvage and doubles remain. I don't really see those being finishable by me in the time left in D1. Granted, I've gotten pretty okay at those. They were always my worst modes, and I still have some severely thumbless matches, but I've also started a mini collection of Zero Death Mercy games in those playlists. But even so, I will not finish those Grimoire cards in time, which means I have failed. It means I don't beat Destiny, at least not according to the strictures I placed on myself. Relic secure. And no, I've never not once picked up a Trials card, so I don't even know if there's a wins tallying Grimoire card for that game mode. So let me close with this. Returning to D1 after the beta was like coming home from a mixed bag vacation. Looking at you, Chicago. You're back to the everyday, the ordinary, the familiar. But hey, it's familiar. You know where the things go. You know the rules. There's not all this pressure to be having fun. And so, sometimes, in spite of yourself, you look around at the everyday, the ordinary, the familiar, and you realize, this, my life, my everyday life, is fun. No alcohol required.